such a long time, I feel like. But today we're doing a meal prep plan with me. And also Maggie is building a kennel for the dogs. If you don't know already, um, we are getting a new dog. So we're going to have two kennels and that will be revealed at the end. Right now I'm just going ahead to cut up some onion and bell pepper. Maggie was finishing up breakfast so she can go and finish the kennel. I did everything in super high speed. This did take me between four and six hours. That was everything I cooked. I made um, stir fry with beef and then I made eight cups of course. Also did a chicken, a baked chicken and broccoli with white sauce. I did a steak, um, Of course, of course, we have to do laundry. Everybody has to do laundry. I did a this or that blog. I did change the blog's name. It will be in the link below. Make sure you check that out. But in this video, I wanted to go ahead and do a this or that. In this um, video, I obviously cooked four or five meals. So I want to know this Comment down below if you'd rather cook one meal every night or four meals on Sunday night. Would you be that? Comment down below and let me know. I saw those veggies and it reminded me I had um, a pan of veggies and then a pan of sweet potato and um, regular potatoes and I just put Tony's on them with that olive oil in the counter which I'll link below. They came out actually really really good. I left them in there for about 45 minutes on 400. my granny had to come in and help and then she said can you make me one of those smoothies and of course I said yes even though I was in the middle of cooking but she actually really enjoyed it I will put the recipe down below if you're interested <laughs> She actually came back. She wanted to try the lo mein. She said it was pretty good. Um, you'll probably see in one of these videos, Jack actually grabbed one off the counter and ate it. So he thought it was pretty good too. This footage was taken on my phone, but I wanted to show you guys where I was in the middle and how messed up my kitchen. Me and Babe just had lunch, which I will insert a picture of my lunch right here. I think right here. I'll insert a picture of my lunch. Um, it was pretty good, but now I'm gonna get done. I have to do hamburger meat and taco meat, and then I'm gonna do. I'll probably be doing bacon in between. But first, I'm going to take a little bit of time and clean the kitchen. If you've seen these videos before, in the middle, I like to go ahead and refresh the kitchen a little bit and then finish and then do a deep clean of the kitchen. My kitchen is a complete disaster. It's been like two months since quarantine. We stopped doing meal prep. So, whew, I'm tired. But we got to get it done. We think meal prep is going to be a lot better. We'll eat better and 
it'll just be easier for us because we are still working from home and we have been doing um, a bunch of things. So I'm watching Jack if you wonder what I'm watching because he got out of the fence some type of way. So we're going to make sure he's staying in the fence. But I miss talking to you guys. I miss filming for you guys. I hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful quarantine. Staying safe, washing your hands. Here comes Maggie. You can see Maggie was talking to me and doing the paintbrush. I feel like it's important to do this in the middle so it's not so overwhelming when you're done with everything. As you can see right here, I turned the TV on. Before that, I watched, um, I listened to two Crime Junkie podcasts and then that was over. I was in the choir for a little bit and then I went ahead and turned on one of the new episodes I hadn't watched of Special Victims Unit Law and Order. if you can tell from this angle but in that bowl I was starting to do um my banana bread muffins and cooking the meat so I don't know if you can tell but I think I come to the other side and show you guys what I'm doing I did get a new mixer I think I actually showed you guys that in another video I got it from Target if I can find it I'll link it down below I really do like it but obviously a big mixer would have been nice <laughs> To me, this is the best part, cleaning the kitchen, getting all the meal prep in the fridge, and my kitchen just looks blank and so nice, so fresh, so clean. Com comment down below, guys, and let me know what is your favorite part about meal prepping or just Sundays in general. To show you guys the awesome kennel Maggie built. <laughs> 